dear students what is the work done on the chain which is resting on the table and some part of the chain is hanging how much part of the chain is hanging if the total mass of the chain is m here only m by nth part of the chain is hanging and uh, here the total length is taken as l by n and here is a uniformly distributed body that's why we have to consider a center of mass of this body therefore the hanging chain should be divided by 2 because you have to take only 50% of the uniformly distributed body therefore you will be getting l by 2n so therefore mass of the hanging chain is m by n and length of the hanging chain is l by 2n so work done in pulling the chain totally on the table is work done on the hanging chain to pull it completely on the table is mass of the hanging chain g and height of the hanging chain so this is going to be the height of the hanging chain here okay so you can consider this as height of the hanging chain g and height of the hanging chain is considered as l by 2n therefore this can be taken as m g l by 2 n square this is said to be work done in pulling the total chain on the surface of the body let us solve the problems related to the chain hanging now you all know that the formula for pulling the, the formula for pulling the chain the work done to pulling the chain on the table is taken as here m g l by 2 n square here n means 1/6 here 1 by 6 is nothing but 1 by n in the place of n you will be getting 6 here so work done can be taken as mg l by 2 into 6 square 36 into 2 that is mg l by 72 is going to be your answer okay so this is the first option